all know the importance of barbershops. They make sure we stay well groomed and of course the ladies like it. Barbershops are places for men to not only get a haircut, but they're also a great place we can go and get a break from our routines. For one barber in Oakland, he calls his shop a sanctuary. And looking at history, that's what barbershops have been since or have been for black men since the 19th century. A place where we can be vulnerable and free to talk about issues in our community. From Oklahoma. Behind every in pair Texas, of clippers, yeah. you'll probably find a barber. And Damon Hunter, support. though, likes to call himself an esteem builder. I want to boost someone's self-esteem for the time that I have with them. That time might not be much, but it's enough. For 24 years, he's been cutting hair. I like the early birds. His first client of the day, <laughs> Carter. How you doing? What's good? How you doing? I can't complain. Come on now. So every time someone arrives into the chair, they are the most important person of my day. When Carter sat in the chair, Damon quickly learned Carter's a singer. It's his life. It really is. Like, I've every multiple years, times been, like, I've whistling. And people are like, where's that whistling come from? And I was like, oh, I guess that was me. Mm. In between the trimming and the tapering, the two talked even and more. It was a time Your for them to remember to never let the role of barber shops in the black community fade away. Damon says it's one of the few places to come and be vulnerable. I don't believe that barbershops are the sanctuary. So when this sanctuary transformation happens. Definitely a focus for me. No, no, no. Go out there and be somebody. Yeah, it looks great. Yeah, yeah. I'm glad you like it. Yeah. Like a brand new man. <laughs> <laughs> about, you know. All of the strands of life are swept away for the next person to sit right here in this chair. All right, so we know barbershops are also an important neighborhood business in areas that really don't have access to capital. We're talking money and property. It's not common in those areas. But I love what he says every single time anyone gets out of the chair. Go out there and be somebody.